Storm. Welcome to the Coach Cameron Podcast, Car Edition, brought to you by BotsGuy.com. Get a bot today, put it on your website. It's supposed to like solve all your problems, but I bet it takes a lot of work. I don't know. I don't use it, but BotsGuy.com might help you. It's AI on steroids. It'll help navigate your whole online experience uh, for your business. BotsGuy.com. I don't use it, but you might want to use it. Go to BotsGuy.com. I'm going to lose that sponsor. Uh, today we're going to be talking about uh, uh, who's controlling the purse strings in in the cost of soccer. You soccer in America, it's controlled by mothers. Mothers are ruining the game. Sorry, Mom. You are the problem. And I finally figured it out in this car ride in 39 degrees in Arizona, which is crazy to think about. 39 degrees in Arizona. That should not be the case. I not leave in Arizona because I want warmth. And this global war- warming trend still wait for, I, I want more. I want a hotter summer. That's what I want. But mothers, uh, mothers are a problem. Ah! Megan! Is, is Megan Rapino a mother? Ooh. Show. Megan Rapino, always make an appearance. And I'll smash Megan Rapino as much as I can, even in my car. So mothers. So I I, I found out it, it's mothers. That's why it costs so much. Soccer is so expensive. I'm in high school. Uh, my son's in high school. And I'm getting charged during high school. You know what the trick is? So as they try to charge you online with your credit card, uh, go to your bank uh, online and put stop put stop payment for that organization like I did. I'm going to have collections come after me soon, but it's going to be hilarious. I'll document that as they try to bill me on repeat mo- mode, and I'm probably going to cause the soccer club my son resides at to start charging interest. I wonder if they even do that. Do they? Comment. Let me know. CCB, do you charge interest for uh, non-payment? Because I'm going to slow roll it. I, I'm just not a fan of paying for uh, heart rate monitors, uh, $100 a month or whatever flip it is, and registration. I don't even know where any of these fees are going, but we're paying for a lot of things that I just don't get. And my son got worse. So what are we paying for? My son's worse. So, yeah. They, I should charge them. Because they made my kid worse. So, oh, lawsuit. Boom. I'm going to sue them. That's going to be another episode. But back to the mothers. Uh, I think I know. It, it's it's the women's fantasies. Women fantasize about things. They, they manufacture things in their brain to create a fantasy. They create a fantasy of their children just going to these exotic places and playing soccer and all these professional and college coaches. They're coming to uh, recruit your kid in some beach in Hawaii or anything it, it, that's what it is and how I know this is I was coaching my son's so a year and a half ago um, I was co- I coached my son's team and I didn't accept payment or anything like that and they still tried to get me fired they still yelled at me they still manipulated me and it was horrifying so soccer coaches out there you know getting paid whatever good for you you should get paid paid lots of money dealing with that crap oh my god Gosh, they're relentless. My son, my son's team only won one game uh, the whole season. So the two seasons we played, we got smashed. We, we didn't win one game. We lost every game. There was one game we were close to 3-2. Uh, in, in a tournament, we actually won a game. And they had girls on the team. No offense to females, but we were an all-boys team. But we won by one. And it was like winning the World Cup. It was amazing that we won it. I wasn't too excited, but the parents were very excited. Anyways, we had a meeting at my house 
and we're tr trying to go and we're going over how we're going to finish the season, team party, all that stuff. And one of the mothers got very teary eyed and started talking about um, we need to go to a out of state tournament. And I'm like, why? I mean, we can't beat anyone in Arizona. Why would we leave it and go Arizona? And she's like, our kids deserve that experience. And I'm like, and I was trying to be careful, what I, you know, but I said I didn't want to really upset her and make her cry even more. But she fabricated this whole thing in her brain that her kid needed to go to, like, a Las Vegas tournament so they can – hit the slot machines and they get a little drunky and, and whatever. And then the kids could be like hanging around, jumping on a bed together. They just love each other. And I was like, what is wrong with this lady? Does she not listen to my podcast? Um, and apparently I just need to do my, I, I've done too many episodes. I need to just repeat, you know, the 20 things I talk about. Uh, so people uh, can remember because people forget every little thing, but she was like crying at my house. I'm like, get out <laughs> no but um it they fantasize these things and that's why clubs are pushing um this whole uh we have a pathway to pro we have a pathway to division one and all that even though they know and i talked to these coaches behind the scene they're just laughing at you parents you know why because after you kind of figure it out you quit and go somewhere else there's a new set of suckers. It just, it's a hamster wheel of just, there's it just more, it just, it doesn't stop. And there's more coming out the door of just the, you know, forgive what I'm about to say, but ignorant fools, the, you just don't know. And that's why this podcast exists. I'm not trying to sell you anything. I'm just trying to tell you the truth. And, you know, a lot of people get upset about it. I'm like, don't, wh why do you care? Yeah, some people hear the truth and be like, okay, yeah, that does make sense. Uh, but they're still going to pay for it. They have no choice. I'm paying for it. I'm still part of paying for this uh, machine that we're a part of. But, yeah, it, that's what it is. It's the, the, it's the women with controlling the money and, you know, Dad's out there like, oh, okay, let's just go, whatever. Um, Vegas, fine. I'll go, I'll go gamble or whatever. But uh, yeah, it, it's 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 a whole scam. We live in one of the biggest cities in the world, Phoenix, Arizona, and there's plenty of competition here. You don't need to travel eight, nine times a year to go be just be good. That's why we have video. Simple as that. And those are my thoughts today. And I apologize. I don't want to be this kind of like, Bleh. but I am. And it's comical. And it does get my blood rising a little bit. Um, but I do have one of these things. I got, I got an Apple. I got an Apple watch. It's my wife's. It didn't work. I got it to work. She got a new one and I'm using hers. And it, it's just, I use it to measure my heart rate. So I'm going to see what my heart rate was during this whole podcast. All right. Have a great day. See you tomorrow, maybe. Peace.